Drew McIntyre crying. Triple H. It's hard to believe it's been 30 years since I was living just up the road on Windy Hill. 1994, I was terrorizing WCW. And then here we are tonight with all of you making history. 16,092 of you making history. Our 60th Sell out of 2024, making history our largest grossing arena event in history right here tonight because of all of you. Thank you very much. But while we're in the middle of that history making event, let's talk about the next history making event coming up in just four weeks. Because in just four weeks, one of the biggest spectacle events on the WWE calendar <sighs> takes place. Brought to you by Riyadh Season, it is Crown Jewel. Yeah. And this year at Crown Jewel, we will make history because it will be the beginning of a new era for WWE. An annual event that will take place with Crown Jewel, where our reigning WWE champion will face our reigning world champion. For both the men and the women. And now here's the catch, neither title will be on the line huh? but I promise oh. you there will be a definitive winner and that winner will be crowned 2024's crown jewel champion huh? that's an interesting champion cup how does this work do they only defend it at Crown Jewel? 50 carats of diamonds that will signify the winner as the best of the best. One of the scariest men I've ever been around. The Samoan werewolf.
Remember what Roman said to Cody. You are in my way in life. But remember what Roman said before that call. Roman gave Rhodes his word. And Roman lived up to the promise. I think the rock is just jealous of them. Come here, boy. Final boss. He's back. One, two, three. I don't know what that means, Brock. You're gonna have to speak English, dude. Cody and Roman don't know what, what it means either. <laughs> <laughs> 